Hi, this is GBP USD and today it's Wednesday, 28th of August 2013 and the time is 10.7 GMT. We are looking at the daily chart of the pair and I'm using uh, Ichimoku Kinko Hyo and I have superimposed Bollinger Bands, Alligator, Bill Williams Alligator and Fractals. Um, we are concerned, all of us, we are concerned about this bearish move of, uh, of the pair. And although uh, we see the bearish move here on the H4 time frame, um, and uh, I would like to, uh, to leave the decision to you whether you will exit now, later, or wait. We will know that this bearish Kumo breakout, which we see on the H4 time frame, is valid when Chiku Span goes down below the Kumo here. This will happen a few pips below uh, our stop loss uh, place, uh, our, st our stop loss level, uh, around 1.54. Ten or fifty-four, fifteen, twenty. Um, so you have two, two options, and then you will know that this is the beginning of a reversal of a bearish reversal. Now, on the daily chart, I see that although, although uh, biases are bullish, we have this flat top Kumo here which may attract the price like it happened in the previous flat top Kumo here. And this horizontal orientation of the Kumo is always um, indicative of possible uh, ups and downs, uh, very strong ones. Uh, the other system of Bolger Bands, Alligator and Fractals, it shows that we had a valid fractal on the upper Bolger Band where, where Little Alligator was curved downwards a few days ago and this is a strong uh, bearish signal, strong sell signal. The only reason I think we should wait till um, we get this confirmation on the H4 time frame is because there is a correlation between Euro USD and GBP USD. And um, this correlation shows that usually when the one when Euro goes up and Euro wants to go up strongly, GBP USD follows. That's the only reason I would like to wait and trail my stop uh, and be flexible with my stop loss till I see how Euro USD is moving because a big uh, bullish move of Euro USD will make uh, GBP USD follow and reverse. Now, you decide if you want to exit now with a loss uh, at the level of um, 100 pips or you want to wait and go for, for a loss at the level of 150 or 170 pips um, in case of, of a bearish reversal or wait and instead of losing uh, things turn bullish and you uh, get into the green zone of profit this is a decision which is totally up to you um, the criterion uh, whether you should stay in or not is the H4 time frame and what happens here in Ichimoku if Chikuspan goes down below the Kumo and validates the bearish Kumo breakout. If you see it validated, you know it is a reversal. So you must reverse position, you must go short. Um, but if that does not happen, and if it doesn't happen because EURUSD may, re may uh, go strongly up and drag 
uh, the pair with it, then it would be a pity to lose this, this money uh, just because of the fear of this move. But against, again, risk management is um, the art of balancing between uh, options and uh, picking uh, the one which is more, more suitable to your account, to your character, and uh, to your intuition about, to your feeling about the market. Thanks for watching and happy pips.